Hi, I'm Karin. I run a stationery shop with my sister Yeni. She figured out what products she wanted to show on the table and planned the displays. She sketched out the size and the placement of everything. My job was to make the table look good and match our branding. At first I wanted to go with a sea and beach theme for the whole boat since we had already designed our packaging in that theme. I sketched some beach decorations with our real rhino and thought about a beach backdrop. But then I realized the waves wouldn't show behind the displays. So I focused on the sky and added some clouds. I think this theme is more universal because it would be odd if we had a summer theme in the winter. Let's unbox it. this tiny thing that you just pop in the corner of this thing. I have no idea what this is called. I don't think I actually need a hammer for this. It's really easy to it I don't think I can assemble this because the holes, you see, it's like going down, but these holes are horizontal. So how? We staan hier voor Jura en er staat onze BTW en onze postbus. It looks like a fancy device, the space thing. display for our boat and at first I wanted to make it really cute but still simple so it's not too distracting but once I made it on the PC I noticed that it was distracting and that simple is better um, so then I played around with some shapes like fish shape, around shape, star shell and cloud and I made, I made this star shape and I think it's really good for deals that we want to show on our boat but for the prices I would do something else I noticed my sticker sheet on the table and thought why not repurpose the template 
I love creating new things while utilizing what I've already designed. First I made one with the logo, but then I realized it wasn't necessary, so I created a version without it. Simple, direct, and it aligns perfectly with our branding. These packages just arrived, so let's unbox them to see what's inside. that we are gonna put the stickers in to protect them from water damage. It's fine. Mm -hmm. It's fine. Mm -hmm. It's not filled so much. It's not really filled so much. Yeah. Watch it like that. I like it. Mm -hmm. Oh, it's like that. I feel like in this vlog you only see me unbox things but that's because you just need a lot of stuff to display the boot and since it's the first time we want to do it well and see how it goes and talking about stuff we have more stuff to unbox <laughs> I love how the stickers turned out, especially the brown ones. I used to hate how it looks because our printer doesn't print brown very well. It's like very light and desaturated. But our manufacturer prints it really well. It's like the same as what I see on my monitor. Um, you can see it here in the middle. I only have the old thank you card. It's very light and yeah, brown is just not dark and saturated. But this is actually how I wanted it to look like. It's just that our printer is not that great. And I love how this one turned out. I also love this one. I used to hate this one because there's a lot of brown in here and yeah. Brown is just really difficult to print for us, but this is so cute. I used to hate it as well because I was rushing this design, I didn't have enough time, but now I just love it. <laughs> and here is another one, the author, single one author, it's also so cute. I just love all the brown ones. Coffee and space. So cute.
We wanted to get a waterproof tablecloth, but we couldn't find one, so we we're just gonna DIY it. Okay. I am preparing our deco stickers. I'm just putting them in plastic bags so they are waterproof. And I love doing brainless tasks. The last few days I had to work on the print files. There are still a few things that we want to print. And one of them is the backing card of this deco sticker. You can't really see what the cuts are. You can only see the color in the front. But we wanted to make a backing with the cut. And I just love doing brainless tasks because it's kind of like a break from all the thinking. And I can just work with my hands. Play stuff. Oh. Uh, two of the same one. <laughs> yes, it's so cute. Look at this. It's not completely white, it's kind of grayish. But I still like the texture. It's such a good quality. as well yeah I think just something that grew because as you can see there are so many different products that we ordered so I think it's understandable that something will grow we wanted to see how long it takes to set up the whole boat so we now went to leave and arrive at the convention plus we wanted to check if everything was packed well in the suitcase for a smooth setup and as expected there were things we could improve little stuff like not knowing where a specific item was slowed us down but the more we practice the quicker we will get we definitely learned a few things so practicing was totally worth it 